gives us the best chance to develop a different view on Pakistan. It would be a view on Pakistan which uh, cares, of course, uh, on, not on Pakistan, of the elite of Pakistan who cares about his own people. It would be a view on a Pakistan which is not only concentrated on security. You, it wasn't only the danger for the West which, uh, which grew in, in Afghanistan, no, also the political groups, why well, no? Is it women, women rightist? Is it human rightist? Is it some uh, uh, educational uh, you know, uh, NGOs? It's not only NGOs, it's all this, you know, if you look at Pakistan, you have millions of people who do something, you know, they, they get organized, they get together, they, they try to get through their life. I think that is the strength of the society. It has to reflect some yeah. of the the army figured out that in the West, meaning in Afghanistan, in order to have peace and no troubles. But what I'm describing is this strategy of strategic so depth. Book, I'm not, I'm not, uh, no, like, like CNN. Sometimes they're like totally biased or unbiased. Bias. You know, we, we, need, we, need, you know, we need people who are capable of reading and the newspapers and reading and critically and see, you know, here your bias is not right. Why the Western countries are not interested in solving this problem? Why they are sitting behind it and are not helping to solve it? Now, Mr. Ambassador He's not my words, his words. <laughs> <laughs> the Pakistan in the last 65, 66 years, uh, that is our age. Uh, but if you look at Pakistan, it becomes very clear that Pakistan has been able to come of age very, very quickly. Because 65, 66 years is nothing uh, in nation's age. But Pakistan in the last 65, 66 years, despite all our problems, challenges, difficulties, we have thank you very much for your friendship, uh, for your uh, interest in Pakistan. And I would suggest that we should give a good round of applause uh, uh, to Mr. Uh, and, uh, the token of our appreciation is a small souvenir from Pakistan, uh, which I'm sure. Thank you very much.